Hey, I'm Gerald Beasley. I'm here at the NAMM Show with Essential Sound Products. And I met my good friend Michael Griffin, the creator of this awesome music chord a few years ago, uh, at my bass boot camp. I'm a bass player, I'm an educator, a recording artist, and uh, one of the things I'm always going for is the ultimate sound. Sound is very, very critical to me in my recordings, in a live setting, and hearing the music chord when I heard it for the first time, it changed my whole perspective on how power can influence the, the, the tonal qualities of my instrument and, and my recordings in general. So I'm happy to tell you a little bit about you know, what, the, what the music chord means to me and my relationship with the Essential Sound products. And uh, yeah, it's going to be fun. I use the Essential Sound products music chord in a couple different applications. I use it live in my DI. I have a DI made by a company called A Designs, which is a, a tube DI. Um, and I use the, the music chord pro in that particular device. And it helps the... It helps my sound become nice and fat. You know, a lot of times, uh, you know, playing with the bass, the, the low mids and the, and the subs can sort of be uh, less defined. I found that the music chord really tightens up that low end. So I always use it with my live DI. I also use it on the, the power amp of my um, Aguilar uh, DB750 power amp, which I love. And that, again, is a tube amp. And, you know, I've had it for years, but when I hooked the Music Core Pro into it, it just took everything to a whole other level. And the third application is in recording my records, and actually I do a radio show, too. I even use it on that in my uh, Avalon preamp, the 737 SP. I make sure I have uh, a Music Core Pro in that, too, because I noticed that uh, the microphones... The, uh, it sounds uh, more defined, the bass response is clean, I mean, it's tighter. So it just works on just about every application. On my most recent CD, the Electric Mingus Project, uh, my engineer used Music Chord Pro on all the outboard gear. In fact, we were scheduled to, to um, release the record. We pushed the release, back, release date back a month because we thought we would take the mixes to a whole other level by replacing all the cables and the, all the chords in the studio with the Music Chord Pro. And the, the name of that album, by the way, I gotta do a plug for my album, is The Electric Mingus Project. So if you check that out, the album out, you'll hear, you know, a sort of an in-the-box mix using Pro Tools, but you'll hear, you'll hear it at a whole other level.